Hey y'all, welcome back. This is part two of our nickel album fill to see how many boxes it takes to fill this album up from 1938 to 1961. Uh, we do have a few spots that we filled with the first box, but not too many. So we'll get this box open and see if we can find anything in here to put in our album also obviously we'll be looking for our foreigns and any varieties that may be out so all right well i'll bring you in on the first find all right roll seven got our first find here 1947 out of philly go to the book and see if that's one we need Nope. Well, we've already got a 47 out of Philly. So this won't upgrade it. So back in the pile it goes. And I'll see you on the next one. All right, guys, row eight. Got our first find of the row, 1958 out of Denver. Look and see if we need that one. No, nope, we've already got it, but I'll check it against the book and see if it upgrades. So, I'll see you on the next one. All right, roll nine. I was going through the roll and saw this one that looked really, really worn out of Denver. I haven't looked at it yet, so let's just hope it's not a 64. <laughs> 1964. I get a lot of them. Well, let's go ahead and check it for the D over D. And I don't see it. All right. I'll bring you back on the next one. All right. Row 11. Got the first find of the roll. 1954 which we've already got a 54 uh denver so we need to see if we can hopefully it'd be a philly let's flip it and see that's a denver all right well, that makes uh two from the 50s and one from the 40s i'm gonna finish the rest of the roll and i'll bring you back if i find anything else same roll Right behind, one coin behind that uh, 54, 1939. Now, we don't have any 39s, so be interesting to see which one it is. Let's see. Oh, suspense. Out of Philly. Get the book real quick. Nineteen thirty nine out of Philly. There was one point two or one hundred and twenty million point six, almost one hundred and twenty one million of them in it. So been nice to get that thirty nine D key date, but all right, well we'll work with what we got. I'll add it to the book. I'll see you on the next find. All right, row 12. I hadn't checked yet to see what it is. But it's a uh, Philadelphia mint. And it just looks old, so I'm hoping it's not another 1964 or something. So, all right, let's see what it is. Oh, 1957. That's a filler. In 1957... There was 39.7 minute. So, that's a good one. Let's see. Uh, I don't have my stuff pulled up. Let me go back to this and get my Jefferson. It's not a key date or semi key date, obviously. But, 
and there's no varieties on it either so anyway at least we have one to put in our book i'll finish row 12 and then i'll bring in if i find anything else all right guys row 16 i saw a couple of them i kind of moved them a little bit i don't know what they are i just saw the mint marks on this one d 1958 do we have a 58 yes we have a 58d all right and uh, right there uh, it's a 1964 out of Philly. All right, well, that's all I could see right now. Uh, if I find anything else, I'll bring in. All right, guys. Roll 17. I just pulled this out. I hadn't looked at the back. I've got the 41P and the 41D. All I need is the 41S. And it's the P. All right. That's fine. So we've got two, two in the 40s, four in the 50s, and one in the 30s. So I don't really see anything else. So I'll finish this row out, and I'll bring you back on the next one. All right, row 18. Just came across this 1961. I've already got both 61s, but it is the Denver Mint, so... We'll add it right there anyway, and we'll check it. All right, I'm going to finish row 18 out, and I'll come back with you if I find anything. All right, guys, row 25. I don't know what year it is. I just saw the mint mark on the back. So we'll find out together. 1964. I'll go ahead and check it for the D over D. And I'm not seeing it. So... That's all I've got so far. I'll come back on the next one. All right, guys, I'm back. Uh, this is row 28. And I saw almost on the end, 1957. I believe we've already got the 57P. So maybe it'd be a 57D. And it is. So, so far, we got two book fillers, a 57P and a... 57D, so we got the uh, 1957s taken care of. That's good. All right. Yep. I really hadn't looked at the row. I just laid it out and saw that, and I brought you in. So if I find anything, I'll bring you in. If not, I'll see you on the next row. All right, guys. Row 29. I was going through. And I came across this 1947. Now we already have the uh, 47P. Hopefully this is the 47D. With only 37.8 million of them being minted. Now it's not a key date or a semi-key date. But with that low of mintage it's probably going to be a harder one to find. So maybe it'll be the S. I don't know but. All right, well, let's see. It's the P. All right, well, we tried. So, let me go ahead and finish this roll out while I got you here. All right, that was it. All right, roll 30 is next. All right, guys, we're back. Roll 30. I uh, got the first find of the roll. Get it zoomed in here. It's a 1951. And as of right now, I don't have any other 51, so this will be a book filler. Fill a slot. Uh, the 51D had 20.5 million. The 51S at 7.6 million. And the 51P had 28.6 million. So if it's an S, it's a semi-key date. All right, well, let's see. It uh, looks like a D. Yep, 
51 day so pretty good at 20.5 million so i'll take that all right we'll add it to the stack here and continue to hunt the roll i'll bring in if i find anything else hey guys i was going through the roll and uh didn't notice it because i had a coin explosion but i found a 1959 now, i don't have a 59 in the book uh so the 59p i had 28.4 million and the 59d at about 160.7 million so let's see if we got the p uh, we got the d which is fine that's good that's a book slot filler so anyway it's not in too bad a shape you can still see some good hairline if you get it in the light right anyway but all right well good we'll uh add that to the stack like i said i had a little coin explosion so anyway i will get back with you on the next find all right guys roll 34 first find of the roll it's a 1960 out of denver which we already have so we'll add it to our stack uh i didn't see anything else that looked older so it's kind of a slow box compared to others hardly got any 1964s or which i usually get a absolute ton of but that's it all right next row all right guys row 36 i had two of them pop out first one is a 1940 which we don't have any of the 40s we got the 41s uh maybe it would be the 40d which is real low minted and there's a d over d or i'm sorry if it's a 40s it's a s over s but Sorry, I got to looking at something wrong. But anyway, let's see what it is. And it's the P. That's fine. The 40P. That'll work. That'll fill a spot. So, and the next is 1957. Which we already have the, the P and D for that. Let's see what it is. It's another D. So, I will have... One to check against the other. Uh, well, I got you here. Since I had two good finds, I'll go ahead and kind of go through this. There's another old coin. At least it has a mint mark on the back. 1961, which we already have. And that's it. So far at all the rolls. Sorry for the glare there. I've only found one 2009, which had low mintages. That's why I kept it. But anyway, all right. Well, we'll get on the next roll. And I'll see if we find anything. All right, guys, row 47. I just, or I'm sorry, row 48. I just pulled out this 1957P, which we already have. So I'll just set it there. And uh, while I got you here, it's been a while since I found anything. The box, the rolls got cold. So we hadn't really found anything. I've only found the one 2009 in the whole box. There's a 1962, which that won't go into the uh, album because it stops at 61. So out of Denver, 
I'll check it against what I've already got. All right, well, that's it. Row 48, next. All right, guys, row 49. I didn't recognize it because it's so nasty. There's a 1959 out of Denver, which I believe we've already got. And then, let's see what this one is. It's a 1946. We need the D or the S out of Philly. We've already got that one. And I believe there's another one. Yep. Denver Minted, 1964. I'll check for the D over D on that. But, uh, yeah, the box or rolls got pretty slow there. So, there's a 1961 out of Denver, which we've already got it. So, I don't see anything else that sticks out to me. So, I'll finish out in the roll, and if I find anything, I will bring you back. Hey guys, Mud here. Uh, Alright, I finished my 50 rolls, and I've gone through and saw what... If anything could be upgraded and what it needed to be added to the album. Uh, it looks like we're going to be adding six new coins to the album. The 39P, the 40P, the 51D, the 57P, the 57D, and a 59D. And I had three upgraders, which the 60D, the 58D, and the 54D. So... Not too bad for the second box. Uh, we'll just see how long it takes. It's going to, I'm the ones I know is going to take the longest probably is the 38s, the 39s, and the war nickels. So, out of two boxes, not too bad. So, anyway, thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next one.